mistake, so <laughs> they, they were a little confused. But okay. I think they're ready now. Yep. Interesting choice by Shoyu and Ollie to immediately go to the ledge and let the other two take center stage. Um, oh, but oh my suddenly God. the Falco is off stage and, and Shoyu. Ollie needs Shoyu. So instantly, both supports got absolutely obliterated, except Shoyu is actually point. Yeah, it shows the point, yeah. But, uh... You know, it's hard to say sometimes in teams, too. But I think in this case, actually, I think Ali does fit more of a support role. Because yeah. Shoyo very much likes going in. Yeah. Um, oh, well, hold Definitely on. In, this, uh, in this team that they have going on right now. And um, Shoyo and Ali with a very strong start. Uh, oh, hold on. Okay. He's doing combos that Falcon cannot reach. Yeah. Good tech away and into the into your Fox teammates. That way, it's like pretty dangerous for the Fal for the Falcon to come through. Mm -hmm. Just shines the Falcon kick. You know, yeah, that is somewhat an underrated aspect of Falcon is that he can send combos up to like the top of the stage, and at that point, it's like no teammate can save you at that point. Yeah. So um, Shoyo taking the uh, oh. like being the first guy down two stocks, but um, Ollie doing a great job tanking for the tanking for both of them and. Uh, Shoyo feeling very confident, and Shoyo probably feeling really confident with uh, Ollie as his uh, take in for the team, so to go in and uh, take those oh take those risks that he needs to take his carry. Oh my goodness! just fell off stage. Oh, and there's been a lot of situations where Lefako's just like, literally run off stage, and he, he's he's hit he's hit the box a couple times now. Yeah. A couple of misplays for sure, but good move right there. Oh, and oh very nice like that. Grab. The tides have been somewhat evened, except the box that 120. Yeah. But. They've definitely brought this back to a slightly Oh more my spot. god. Oh, hold on. This is big. Yeah. All right. Oh, oh. and the flop there barely missing it. I well, cannot believe Ollie yeah. got a knee out of that. That was incredible. Up oh my throw god. Throw a double jump and he just barely missed. Okay. Oh. Oh. And they're both off stage. Neither of them could decide who's going to yep. take the Oh ledge. my god. Stanky tried to do the most insane save I've seen in my life, but that definitely did not work out. I like the idea, but the issue, I think he was trying to land on stage, and that's what kind of messed him up. Mm. Um, it was also honestly like kind of a, yeah, you're right. He probably tried to land on stage with that, yeah. but it was it would have been really close. It was an awkward spacing, and yeah, ended up being a. He probably felt like he had to, though, because it was definitely the, their last stocks. That's true. I think it was a fair risk to take. Unfortunately, it just didn't pan out. Oh. And I feel like on that spot, Ollie, yep. you probably, yeah, good nair. I feel like on that spot, you probably just want to give Falcon the knee when you rapid boost What's there. What's he doing? Okay. I don't know. I was going to say, if that side be hit, I think that did, that would have literally saved him. But thankfully, it didn't hit. Yeah. Ollie definitely MVP'ing that game. It felt like... There was that, that point where, where both where both green team was off stage was definitely the pivotal point. One of them got need, the other one got hit off stage, and from there the game kind of lost. The, the game went pretty lopsided. Oh, overall, definitely playing a pretty good support this time around. He's yeah. getting the he's getting conversions that they need to, and that Falcon needs to get in teams. And he's also doing a good job getting disruptions. I noticed like a pretty good like uh, raptor boost from him. It's like oh, good, yeah. it's a good play from him because it's like in like teams it's like you either get a combo or it's like if you hit your teammate then you like lock it then you like get him out of the situation. Oh, and again at the start, green team just kind of throws himself off stage in an unfortunate accident. Mm. You know, honestly though, I still do it. I, I still think the FD pick is fine. I think they both they both want to still keep controlling with lasers, and they both have it's like Fox and Vagos both have good enough hitboxes to be controlling a lot of the stage. That's a good point. I feel like. I feel like if you're green team, you want to like try to fo you want to try to focus down the weakest link. And I think in this case, you'd want to you'd want to fight Ollie more, you know? Like you want to keep him as much out of the fight as po as, you, as you possibly can, because that's what we saw uh, earlier with uh, with uh, Shoyo and Ollie versus uh, Nut and Lavez, where it's like they started winning once they really just started not letting Ollie be able to enter into these interactions. Yeah. Good laser by by. Uh I thought I was going to interrupt the... Edge okay, board. that was a pretty good idea from oh. Stanky, but uh, didn't quite get the up B at the end to keep Ollie up in the air long enough. Now, he was just keeping he was just keeping uh, Ollie in the corner. That was good. Yeah. Ollie finally finding his way back in. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. And Shoyo going off stage. Ollie's going to cover. Oh. oh, misses the back air. I think... 
I think they like he knew he was coming to the ledge, but I think they just it was just a little too like impulse. It was just too, it was a little too all of a sudden. They weren't fully ready for it. Yeah. All these other percent was literally everything is throwing him around. Yeah. But oh. neither of Green Team is there to capitalize. In fact, they're all in the back push from Shoya. Oh, and, wow. Great up air. Oh, that's a good play from Stanky, but he doesn't finish the stock. And that would have been a big uh, that would have been a big swing in their favor if they managed to do that. Oh. Dang. I see that SK has been like trying a lot to try to. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! oh. He's trying to take the stock. He's before. trying to take the stock, but Ollie now. just deleted it. Wow. Um, no one decides to take the stock for the pause. Uh, I mean, it's already at the point where it kind of looks like that the match has been decided. Um, the big way. I that that back throw is good, and then you keep yeah, you keep going with the Falcon. You have to switch, you have to switch targets a lot, and a lot of the times you can't, you don't really have time to go against, to go for the edge guard against these characters. Mm. Okay, so awkward follow up, but that should be it. Yeah. yeah. No, I was right. So it honestly kind of so yeah, it kind of looks like all these shows are just are just really like dominant, are just really like controlling them right now. The biggest issue, the biggest issue is, is uh, rather the fox just died way too fast. He, he lost his lock at the beginning fast, and he, he just kind of... He's he, getting nicked a lot for trying to hit Ollie. Like, I noticed him, like, trying to, like, like boxing out Ollie, and it's like, he's doing a good job, like, keeping him out. But then it's like, he messed up once, and Ollie gets a double jump over him, gets a stomp, and then deletes the stomp off of that. Yeah. So it's like, I think... So for one thing, um, I know that we mentioned that FD was, like, kind of a good pick, but it kind of seems like that they're still giving Ollie too much room to run. So I'm thinking that... Maybe they want to go to a smaller stage, make it so that it's like, if they're going to get into a scramble situation, Ollie kind of is forced to be a part of the scramble. Yeah. And I think they really wanted to make it so that Ollie can't, Ollie has a harder time entering in on his own terms. Because right now it seems like that he's able that's to true. do that. He, that. That's true. He's definitely going a lot on his own. And I think they might run it back still. They're, they're looking at FD right now. Yeah. They're having, they're trying to discuss some sort of strategy for it. Because I think the FD pick can definitely work, but I really want to see what they try to do with it if they try to go back to FD. Oh, are they going what bigger? The? They, they are. Bigger. Interesting. Okay, let's see how this, I, if their strategy has changed at all. Well, how their strategy plays out. I think maybe out. they're going to try and maneuver around platforms for Holly. Or I think they might be trying to give uh, the Falco more room to run and the end, so that way he can enter on his own terms. Maybe. It's, uh... Oh. And he... He got nicked. Yeah, good. he's also... But he got nicked. Yeah. Oh, and Shoyo's going for another gimp. Mm -hmm. Oh, my oh God. Oh, my God. Oh, but they're still alive. Oh, oh. and the shine. Good edge guard from SK. Um, all he's doing a good job of stalling out there and waiting for his teammate to come back. Yeah. So oh, all he's got a nice percent where if they hit him away. Oh! oh! But that sucked. Baited right into the down smash. Yeah, he got bopped. Yeah. Oh, and he double jumped into the down air. You know, some way that bait was like kind of cool because like I, it might not have been intentional, but it was like. The basic oh idea was. Oh my god, is that it for Shoyo? Sure? Oh, nope. No, it's not. And they he actually, with the drill shine, he, got, he let Ollie come back. Yep. Shoyo's sure gotta be careful. He keeps ending up off stage, he's almost already down to his last stock. Oh no. Oh, when Ollie just throwing himself down. Oh, good shot. Yep. Yeah, right now, like, the red team is, like, not. I mean, I'm sorry. Uh, Snakey and SK, green team, are not doing a really good job of, like, uh, locking down their hits versus Ollie. Like, like I saw before where, like, uh, SK was oh. trying to go for a smart forward smash on a platform against oh, Ollie and, like, whip completely. So it's like they're doing, like, these really high committed moves when they, like, don't have to. It's kind of like they don't want to actually kill him. They want to be able to, like, control him and, like, just, like, be able to hit him away long enough so that they have enough space to work in Oh, and hold on. Falco's gone. Fox is getting comboed. Oh, but it's okay. It's okay. Oh, and double jump. Is that it? What a yeah. grab. And the, the get-up attack knocking him off stage. All right. Oh, that, that? Oh, no. Oh. And he needs the shit out of Shoyo. I feel like that was a spot where they needed to oh. take a killer, killer too. 
That was a spot where they could have killed either of them, but they managed to get neither. And I think it would have been really important for them. Okay, well, Snake right can now. give this kill right now. Oh, they could give a double the... kill oh, right now. Oh, okay. And with the up B, I think that's it. Okay, All right. they've managed. They've got the. They've got their backs now. All right, that was. That was the key. That was the. The key stocks to take. Um. Oh, Snakey tried to uh, save him with the high lasers. I thought those lasers were really good too. They just like barely yeah. avoided Ollie. So probably in that spot, like SK probably wanted to angle his up B more because I feel like he could have like angled it up oh. and then gotten hit by the lasers. And yeah, that that top platform maneuvering that uh, the Falco just did—that's literally why they went to Dreamland. Oh, true. and he back here at the knee in oh. time. And this switch was huge, and oh he just no! This is the double lasers off the ledge. This is big. Oh, and then sh Shoy gets the grab. And in some twisted form of karma, the way they get through the last round, they might lose this round. Yeah. This is actually. Oh, hold on. Oh, okay. hold on. He gets a stock off of uh, That Ollie. was the most ridiculous looking forward smash. Oh, oh. good grab. Wait no. for it. Oh, and the Dreamland platform stops him. That was such a risky nair. Yep. Oh, Try. good shine to keep the pressure Oh, up. the get up attack. What? Oh, the oh that's a oh, smash. Good. He does it. And Shoyo not 3-0-ing them. Shoyo and Ollie unable to 3-0 them. Shoyo losing five socks that game. Yep. I'm gonna. I had to make sure he eats his words on stream. <laughs> and you know, they, he, the Falco, he accidentally killed himself, but they ma they made it through, dude. That's good. I thought that was the end. I thought but that was the end too, was, especially like with the grab. Yeah. He but held he held his own enough, and he managed to catch Ollie. Was I think the big thing because yeah, Ollie exactly. was taking point despite being extremely high percent. That's true. And it's just the. Uh, he needed the one nick, and then he like kept control long enough versus Shoyo to close it out. Yeah, Shoyo was like just like wake up reacting on everything. Yeah, it was a really good game attack though. I thought that was. It was a really good game attack. <laughs> that was it, dude. It was a lot of uh, there's a lot of spaghetti. Both of them really desperately wanted to close that out, but uh, like SK like kept it was like patient enough to like to like close it. I'm so surprised that led into an up smash at the end. That last that second to last hit, I did not think that Di was gonna go like he landed like in his arms. Yeah, he did. Ready to get up smash. And they go back. This is an interesting decision. Um, I guess if, if you're Shoyo and Ollie, right? Like, I, I'm sure Ollie at least feels comfortable here. Yeah. It just as just as much as Green Team, right? Like. Yeah, exactly. I think honestly, like, I mean, remember what I mentioned before about how like oh. traditionally I would sort of like. And like every other game, one of them dies at the start of the match. Yeah. Yeah, SK not doing a great job of holding on to his stocks, but oh. it's okay because Snakey has been doing a pretty good job. Oh, they're going to try to save each other. Oh, no. Okay, he's got one more shot. Oh, good read on the going up, so that way he can... Uh... Okay, interesting choice with the up smash. Uh, looked like they were trying to cover Shoyo with the back hit. Didn't look like it would work, but Shoyo misses the ledge regardless. Oh, okay. Oh, he, I can't believe that he got that second up there. That was amazing. All right, so I remember originally I said that uh, Green Team wanted like less space in order to be able to sort of take control of Fal in order to sort of take control of Falcon, but they're doing a really good job at um, at using the space to actually stay away from the other team. Yeah, the, the Falco full hops are really pulling through, I think. Oh, but hold oh, on, that's huge. And that's a big stop. They for finally caught him getting oh, hit, oh and they Nick show you right back. That's a that's such a good use of invincibility is just taking the up B hit and just shining the hell out of him. Yeah. Because that's something you, you can only do in that spot. And hold on. Down smash. Alright, oh. good after from Stanky. Oh, okay. They hit him off stage. It looks like Yeah. They they're keeping him off, and I think right now They're doing a really good job of having one spacey take the role of edge guarding and then the other one just like keeping Shoyo keeping Ollie. Yeah, away from Ollie him. has just been stuck in center stage. And now and, but the they get the reversal, turned. yep. That is that is Fox. Oh, up, up oh. Tilt for some reason. That's interesting. The, All right. the reason why that's weird is because you usually want to end edge guards as soon as possible. Yeah. Like you either get the kill or you like re or you like retake control. Yeah, exactly. Oh, hold on. This is big. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, interesting fair. Oh. And now he doesn't have a, he's done. Oh, he misses the angle on his up B and yes, that will shine. be it. Shine. And, oh, that's another oh. shine! Oh! Oh, he's oh, comboing no. him. Hold on. He this really is, needed to just get really the shine on that stock. Because now every time he nicks all he actually has a chance to do a 1v1. That is true. Oh, and oh. Junair shine. Oh, oh, but he, gets, he sees the tech in. And that is and it. Yeah, that's really yeah, good. Yeah, that's it. He has to up me there. Good back air. Show you has got the ledge. Good closeout from Ollie. Getting the knee on the roll in. They were really starting to pull it together. It just felt like it, they, it felt like they were always down. Yeah. Even if the neutral itself didn't seem that bad. Like, I thought they were doing enough damage. They were just losing stocks faster. SK always lost the first stock, like, consistently. I, I, don't, I don't get it. They last, like, three games. And we never really, we never really figured out why. Most of we is like we, we don't, we aren't in the game it quite yet. so fast. <laughs> like, like, I don't know how they got nicked off stage, but like, I think because.